Good morning, uh, students. Uh, last class, we started a discussion about the optical storage media. We came to know about that, what its physical structure and its technology, how it was covered with the label, protective layer, reflective layer, rigid plastic, and what are the basic uh, the technique, audio data rates, and what is the capacity of the optical storage media. And today, uh, let's be discuss about uh, Compactix Crystal Audio 8 to 14 modulation. <clears throat> the restricted laser resolution is the minimum distance between transitions, pit to land, land to pit. At least two zeros between two ones. This means each change from pit to land or land to pit corresponds to a channel bit one, bit of one. If no change change takes place, the channel bit is zero. On other hand, the pits and longs cannot be too long. Otherwise, a pace correct synchronization signal clock cannot be derived. The maximum length of the pits and lands was thus limited such that there can be at most 10 consecutive zeros as a channel bits. The maximum distance between the transitions of pit to land and the land to pit will be the only two, but it should be not, not more than 10 consecutive zeros. For, the reason, for this reason, <coughs> the bits written on a CDDA in the form of pits and lands do not correspond directly to the actual information. Before writing, 80 to 14 modulation is applied. This transformation ensures that the requirements regarding minimum and maximum lengths are met. 8 bit words are coded as 14 bit values. Given the minimum and maximum allowed distances, there are 267 valid, val valid values of which 256 are used and we can see that there is a coded table example of the coded table with the direct sequencing of modulated bits 14 bits are there from data bits 8 to channel bits 14 bits it is still possible that the minimum distance of two bits would not be met or the maximum distance of 10 bits would be exceeded. Three additional bits are inserted between successive modulated symbol to ensure that required regularity is met. So we can see that the minimum distance is only 2 bits and the maximum distance only the 10 bits. Then the additionally there will be a merging a simple example of how we can able to use the how we can come, come to know about that how it's going to be inserting external uh, bits 8 bit separate format and as well also it, uh, it's a converted 14 bit modulated data and you can see that here this is a merging bits by external uh, zeros and ones now let me discuss about that error handling concept. The goal of error handling on a compact disc digital audio is the detection and correction of typical error patterns. An error is usually the result of scratches, dust, fingerprints. This can be usually characterized as burst errors and it should be get corrected and it should be detected and as well as it must be corrected. Uh, so there will be in um, two levels of read Solomon code uh, with uh, frame interleaving operations. We can perform on two different levels. So in the first level of uh, error handling, uh, error handling. So which is going to be implementing in two stages. One is uh, error correction, error detection, and correction. So by taking help of the read Solomon algorithm. For every 24 audio bytes or data bytes, there are two groups of correction data bytes, two groups of correction data bytes, each of uh, contain the four bytes. 
the first group corrects single byte errors while the second group corrects double byte errors the first in out of uh, this starting two groups the first group is going to be correcting the single and second group is going to be correcting the double bytes error in the second level so by taking help of the frame interleaving operation real calls get you data bytes are distributed over multiple frames here the frame is going to be consist of 4588 channels and bits is equals to 24 audio data bytes the audio data are stored interleaved on the cdda in this way the burst error will always damage only part of the data so instead of entire all surface of the uh, compact the frames usually it's going to be consist of audio data error correction additional control and display bytes synchronization pattern the first one the audio data is which is going to be divided into two groups of 12 bytes each they they contain the high and low bytes of the left and right channels additionally the error detection and correction bytes which is going to be described in the uh, above format to each frame in two groups of four bytes each by taking according to the read solomon algorithm the each frame has control and display byte consisting of eight bits designated like p q r s t u v w sub sub channel bits from 98 frames are collected and used together yielding eight sub channels of 98 bits each of which 77 bits are used for actual information every 98 frames which is going to be forms a block unfortunately sometimes the blocks are also called frames and also we have that lead in area and as well as lead out area so before that let me make it to conclude about the the synchronization pattern in the in the frames the synchronization pattern determines the synchronization pattern which is going to be determines the beginning of each frame it consists of 12 ones 12 zeros and also three filler bits which is equal into the 27 the first one in the area of compact disk on the surface of the compact disk there will be a lead in area lead out area and also we have a program area um, three areas is uh, is available in the cdda the first one is lead in area the lead in area contains the directory of the cdda the beginning of the individual tracks are registered here the program area includes all tracks of the cdda compact disk digital audio the actual data are stored here at the end of each cdda there is a lead out area this is used to help the cd player should inadvertently read behind the program area the program area of each cdda can consist of up to 99 tracks of different lengths A CDDA consists of at least one track, whereby a track usually consists of, uh, is just example like which is going to be using a song or a movement of uh, symphony. Random access to the beginning of each track is possible. So according to the Red Book specification, each track can have a multiple index points, allowing direct positioning at certain points. Usually. only two predefined index points here index point 0 is start of the tracks and uh, index point 1 start of audio data and uh, tra track pre gap uh, is part between the uh, track ip0 and also ip1 ip0 and ip1 uh, ip0 marks the beginning of uh, the each track ip1 marks the beginning of the audio data within the track the area which in a track between ip0 and ip1 is called the called the track pre gap cdda disk have a track pre gap of 2 to 3 seconds per pieces
this uh, so is going to providing some basic information summarizable information of the compact disc uh, digital audio so which is going to be suitable for the typical arrest caused by the damage dust in audio data cd da specification is based for family of optical storage media absolutely but not conceivable, conceivable conceived for video and as well as the discrete, discrete data and this is desired simultaneous playback of various media uh, like uh, audio or it can be in video so any kind of uh, the small the motion this is the, the basic information about the some of the techniques what we can able to uh, check in the cdda so thank you very much